Hello, Lauren. Good afternoon. Thank you for joining today's call. Well, great to see you too, Yunla. So, as we recently received the APR critical guidance recognition, we have a lot to talk about today, right? Yes, I'm happy to walk you through the whole process. Okay. So, to begin with, why don't we start by introducing SK Chemicals Americas first? Sure. SK Chemicals America is a subsidiary currently based in Irvine, California, operating across North and South America. Our company supplies copolyester and functional polyester products and has recently prioritized the expansion of our sustainable product portfolio, which includes recycled PET and PETG. All right, then shall we move on to our main topic for today? Let's discuss what APR is and what activities SK Chemicals is doing with APR. APR, or the Association of Plastics Recyclers, is a nonprofit organization based in the U.S. dedicated to advancing the plastics recycling industry. Recognized internationally, APR serves as a credible authority, offering standards and guidelines through resources like the APR Design Guide, which helps identify recyclable products. Then, what types of members are typically associated with APR? APR's membership is composed of diverse range of stakeholders within the plastic industry, from recycling companies, resin suppliers to global brands. A variety of key players in the plastic industry actively participates as members. Now, this inclusivity empowers APR to not only contribute to discussion on plastics regulations and legislative reviews in the U.S., but also grants the association a voice alongside lawmakers. So, in line with the increasing demand for APR. Compliance recyclable products. SK Chemicals has also participated for a PR recognition program, right? Yes, you're absolutely right. Five of SK's PET grades have received the critical guidance recognition after being tested with a strict APR guideline. Now, about the process of gaining this recognition, could you please provide some insights of how the process went? The process included a comprehensive evaluation of our resins by a third-party testing lab to assess the recyclability according to APR standards. And based on this test data and the webinar we presented, the APR Technical Committee thoroughly reviewed and confirmed that our technology aligns with the APR standards, granting us the esteemed critical guidance recognition. Now, given the credibility of this program, the journey was quite extensive and complex. Particularly, as you presented the webinar, which was a really important part of the whole process, what aspects did you focus on while preparing for the presentation? Well, I mainly focused on highlighting the unique technical properties that set our material apart from others in the industry. Additionally, I tried to underline the accomplishment of our PET grades and overcoming processability limits of traditional PET while maintaining its aesthetics. Now, our customers have shown significant interest in these distinctive features. It would be great if you could elaborate more on the advantages of our sustainable solution. Of course. So, as you said, our materials offer enhanced processability compared to conventional PET, enabling our customers to mold thicker parts and different packaging designs with excellent clarity. And most importantly, it is still classified as RC number one, just like PET, ensuring it can be recycled in the PET recycling stream. Additionally, we brought on our sustainable product portfolio by providing both mechanically and chemically recycled products with a wide range of recycled content from 30%, to 50%, and up to 98%. So after gaining the recognition, our company's name and grade names are listed on the website, right? What other advantages do we have? Furthermore, we've obtained an official letter enhancing the credibility of our products. Then after gaining this recognition, how have customers responded? We've received positive feedback on our PCR containing grades, and I was very pleased to hear our customers acknowledge their equivalent physical properties and transparency compared to virgin copolyester grades. Many expressed interest specifically in running trials with the APR grades as well, and there's definitely a growing interest in collaborating for future recognition programs. And I look forward to witnessing how SK Chemicals will navigate challenges and make advancements aligned with the sustainability-focused industry trend. Yes, so SK Chemicals will continue to enhance collaborations with customers across various sectors such as cosmetics, beverage bottles, food packaging, and so on. And also, we anticipate the inclusion of numerous APR-certified grades within our expanding products. Furthermore, with a commercialization target set for next year, we are actively involved in R&D projects focused on recyclable material for extrusion bowl molding and shred fill. 
Down the road, I think the collaboration between us, SK Chemicals America, and the headquarters is going to be even more important. I believe that's going to be the key. Yes, absolutely. So we've had a lot of discussions about our activities with APR today. And before we wrap up, do you have any last comments you'd like to give? Yes, as we navigate a world where plastics often get a bad rap for their environmental impact, SK Chemical stands at the forefront of sustainability. We're dedicated to creating responsible materials, both recyclable and crafted from recycled content, and delivering genuine, sustainable solutions to our valued partners. And honestly, I'm very thrilled to be a part of this impactful journey. Yes, I totally agree with you. I'm also very pleased that SK Chemicals can play a significant role in this collaborative pursuit of sustainability alongside our customers. And it is my sincere hope that these collective efforts will contribute to the establishment of a more sustainable and environmentally conscious industry. Yes, I wish the same as well. Well, thank you for joining today's call. No, thank you for having me. So next time, we'll be back with more insightful topics. Sure. For now. Bye. Bye.